Vikings add depth to the defensive line by signing defensive tackle Julian Taylor. Literally had no idea who this was before today. Probably because the last time he played was in 2019 with the San Francisco 49ers. He played six games then. The year before that, 2018, another six games. Now, in 2019, he initially missed a handful of games after suffering an elbow injury. There was optimism that he would maybe return versus Seattle in the season finale. Three days before that game in practice on Thursday towards ACL. 2020 comes around and maybe he can get an increased role if he can get healthy because 2018 preseason, Julian Taylor showed a lot of promise. But okay, 2020, here we go. Redemption tour. Starts the season on the pup list before ultimately being waived November of that year. The following February, three months later, he signs with the Tennessee Titans, Julian Taylor. All right, the pass is a pass. Let's move forward. Forward he went until June, just a few months after signing with Tennessee, he gets cut. The last two years, he's really been down on his luck, which brings us to now. Just signed with the Minnesota Vikings, gets another chance to show what he's got. Worst case, he's a camp body that inevitably gets cut again, or for his sake, I really hope he can jumpstart his career again and be a rotational piece on the defensive line for this Minnesota Vikings team. I hate seeing stories like this. I wish him the best of luck. Vikings signed Julian Taylor. Let's see what he's got.